Pakatan Harapan is keeping its promise of a leaner cabinet, at least for now. It is 21 ministers, less than the 35 under the previous Barisan National-led government. The lineup was approved by the Yang Dipertuan Agong, Sultan Muhammad V, on Friday evening. Tun Dr. Mahathir Mohamad is the Prime Minister. Datuk Sri Dr. Wan Aziza Wan Ismail is the Deputy Prime Minister, as well as the Women and Family Development Minister. Tan Sri Muhyiddin Yassin was named Home Minister. Dr. Mazli Malik replaced Dr. Mahathir as the Education Minister. And Rina Harun is the Rural Development Minister. The surprise selection is Selangor Menteri Bursa, Datuk Sri Muhammad Azmin Ali, who was named Economic Affairs Minister, while Zuraida Kamarudin is Minister of Housing and Local Government. Lim Guan Eng is the Finance Minister, Anthony Lok the Transport Minister, while Gobin Singh Dio is the Communications and Multimedia Minister. Mohamed Sabu was named Defence Minister. Zuraida said in her Facebook page that she was humbled to know about her appointment. She said many substantive improvements and suggestions can be implemented by her ministry, including issues of the rights of minority groups and indigenous people. M. Kula Segeren described the new job as a mammoth task for him, but he had touched on the labour practices throughout his 17 years as MP. After winning the general election for almost two weeks, the Pakatan Harapan ministers can finally look to be sworn in on May 21st morning.